Hi there, welcome to deepcreators.com. In this video, we'll show you three things. First, how to install Python. Second, how to get data and code. And third, how to use Python for deep credit risk analytics. Let's get started. To get started, you visit our website, deepcreditrisk.com, and you click on the Start button at the top. You then go to the button Get Python, click on it. This will take you to the Anaconda website, where you can download the Anaconda software, which includes various software packages. You click on the button Get Started, and click on the button Install Anaconda Individual Edition. At the next page, you will scroll down to the bottom and choose your operating system. You then save the installation file in your download folder. The process may take two to three minutes. After the download is complete, you open your Windows Explorer, go to the download folder and run the installation file. You will then be prompted a few questions. Importantly, under advanced options, add Anaconda 3 to the system path environment variable and press install. This process may take three minutes. After the installation is complete, you finalize by clicking next twice on the finish button. In the second part, we show you how to get data and code. You visit our website, deepcreditors.com, and you press on the button data and code. You then fill out a form. You are then taken to another website where you can download the data and the code. We now move the data and the code to a new folder that we have called DCR. You need to unzip the code. And you're ready to go. In our third part, we show you how to use Python for deep credit risk analytics. To use Python, you need to work with an IDE. An IDE is an integrated development environment, and we choose Jupyter Notebook. To open Jupyter Notebook, you go to Windows Start, go to Anaconda 3, and open Jupyter Notebook. Jupyter Notebook is operated through your browser. A window opens that looks like an explorer, and you go to the location where you have saved the data and the code. Once you reach your folder where you placed the data and the code, you open a new Jupyter Notebook. You press on New and then Python 3. You are able to rename the Jupyter Notebook. In my case, I rename it to Get Started. And I will now import the data and the code by writing prompt DCR import all. I run the line by pressing Shift Enter, and we get an error message that package PyDot has not been installed. To install the package PyDot, we open under Anaconda 3 the Anaconda prompt window. And in Anaconda prompt, we type pip install PyDot. We press Enter. We then go back to our Jupyter Notebook and rerun the line from DCR import star, pressing Shift Enter. We then get a second error message that package tabulate has not been installed. To install tabulate, we again open the Anaconda prompt window. We type in pip install tabulate and press Enter. We go back to our Jupyter Notebook and run the code from DCR import all a third time by pressing Shift Enter. And you get a third error message that the path to your data has been specified not correctly. We go back, open the file dcr.py, 
you go to line 71. And replace the path by the location where you've saved your data. In the case you took it a notebook and data is in the same location, you may just delete the path and link to the dcr.csv data file. And then save the code and close the window. Go back to your Jupyter Notebook and run the line a last time without any error messages and you're ready to go. You can view the data by typing data, shift enter. You can extract variables such as the FICO score at loan origination. value ratio at origination. You can describe data by changing the describe command. And other commands such as rounding the numbers to two decimals. You're now ready to go. We recommend you start with our second chapter, the Python literacy chapter and work yourself through chapter by chapter. We hope you found this video helpful. Please visit our website regularly and check out the updates. Thank you very much, have a great day and goodbye.